California grown oranges. Hi, can I help you? Yeah, do you know if this is organic or not? I'm not sure if it's organic, sorry. Do you know where it was sourced from? No, I don't know where it's sourced from either. Alright, thank sorry. you. Sorry. Hmm. There should be a convenient way where I can find out where this is sourced from. And that's why I decided to develop an app using Panther Chain. Panther Chain is a open source and public blockchain implementation which is going to be used to help solve our problem to deliver the product from the farmer's hands to the consumer. Hey, how are you? Great. So I have this new idea which would implement blockchain technology which would help simplify the processes between farmers, shippers, distributors, and consumers alike. Are you interested? Great. I can get you on board and ready to start as soon as possible. Is that good with you? All right, perfect. Thank you. Bye-bye. Hey, bro. Yeah, I think we're ready. Yeah. We'll see. I'm just adding up some final touches. That's it. Uh-huh. Okay. So this is the skeleton UI that we have made for the project. The application is how the users, multiple type of users will be interacting with the blockchain. So there are different types of users in a supply chain, right? Uh, the first one are the farmers. Then after that, there's middlemen like the wholesaler, the shippers, the brokers, the aggregators and all those. After that comes the retailer and after that the consumer. So this application will have the ability to make accounts and do whatever they want to do with the blockchain. So first of all, you have to create an account. You go in there, you type in your name, unique ID, you select the type of user that you are and submit it. After that, it takes you to a page where you scan the QR code on the product and submit it. This, this time, if you're, a, if you're a farmer, then you are the one who generates the QR code. You stick it on your uh, produce. And after that, uh, whoever scans the code will access the data as well as add some of their own to the uh, product information like addi additional stuff that's needed for, the, needed for the journey of the product. Then you submit this and that's it. So you can also sign in and scan and view the uh, details of the product anytime you want. If somebody is a consumer who just wants to know the origin of the product they are buying, they can just tap this button, I don't care, show me the product. They can scan the QR code and sh it shows them what's the origin of the product, who's the farmer, what's the quantity of the product here, oranges that was shipped originally, what's the certification, like here we can see it's USDA farm, who was the aggregator. In this case, it was Farm Hub and retailer Publix because they are going to buy it from Publix. So that's how they're going to interact with the blockchain. This application in conjunction with Panther Chain is going to be our solution for supply chain tracking. Hey, Farmer Joe. Hey. My name is Steve. I'm an entrepreneur wanting to simplify your process of delivering your goods to the consumers using blockchain. Oh really? How do you yeah. do that? So do you have any product that's ready to be shipped out today? Actually I do. Alright, so it's as simple as putting this QR code onto the product. And then what do I do after that? You just scan it with your phone. It's that easy? Yeah, and just create an account and it'll be processed through blockchain. Thank you. No, no problem. Thank you, Farmer Joe. Wow, it really is that simple these days, huh? Yeah, it is. What an age we live in, my friend. Hey, I have your new shipment. Just stand here uh, and verify with our new innovative tech process. I'll be great. Have a wonderful day. Oh, how convenient, California locally grown.